Hey, hello, welcome. In this video, I am going to show you how we can create ATP connection in Oracle integration. So, for creating ATP connection, we require ATP details. So, as we know that ATP Autonomous Transaction Processing is a cloud database, and we can connect to this database using wallet also. So, all the details related to the wallet, username, password, everything that you can get from the DBA team. So as I have already the details, so here you can see that I have connected this database in my SQL developer application. So here if you will see the details, this is my ATP details. So username is that fox underscore ATP1 password and that as I told you, this is the Oracle cloud database. So here we have wallet. So here connection type, I have selected cloud wallet and I have prov provided that zip file for that wallet. And the service name, it's coming here. So you have to select the service name as high. Okay, so all the details like service name, configuration, wallet, everything you will get from DBA team, right? So let me go and create the connection. So remember, while creating the connection, you required wallet password also. So when DBA team generate this wallet, right, wallet zip file, that time they created the password for that wallet. So you have to ask that password also. Okay, so let me go and create the connection. So here for creating the connection, we have to navigate to the design. Inside the design, we have connections. So as I am going to create connection for ATP database, so I will select ATP adapter here. So here in I will select ATP, yeah, Oracle ATP, and it will ask you the password. This is name, sorry. So XX, I will provide ATP. Sorry, ATP connection. So here XX ATP connection and now it will be trigger and invoke. You can use as a trigger, invoke or whatever trigger and invoke also. So I will suggest to create uh, connection as a trigger and invoke so that you can use this connection anywhere in your integration from a starting to end or anywhere. Okay. So now just click on this create button. After once you will click on that create button, it will ask you the details. It will ask you the uh, ID, password, name and all. Okay. So here you can see in properties for creating the connection, I don't require host and all because I have selected the cloud wallet. So I will not go for that. Yeah, this is the security here. You should select JDBC over SSL and here wallet, you have to upload the wallet. So I will upload the wallet here. So just select the wallet. I have already downloaded the wallet. So yeah, I have uploaded the wallet. And now it's time to provide the wallet password. So I will provide the wallet password as I have received from the DBA team. And now username and password. So here you can see that username is this one. I will use this user here. And the password. Password I remember. So this is my password. So now this details is enough to connect with the database. So just click on this test button. So once everything will be fine, it will be able to create. So right now you can see I am getting error. So let me check why I am getting error. So something I have missed. Yeah. So here you can see that I didn't provide this service. So somewhere I have to provide the service details, right? So in optional, yeah, here we I have to provide the service. So you can see the service is Fox Dev one ATP underscore high. Fox Dev one ATP underscore h i g h i yeah so now i have to click on this test so that it can verify and it will able to create the connection so now you can see that we get the green and successfully message so connection xx atp connection was tested successfully and it's progress 100 percent it means that we are successfully able to create the connection so now i have to click on the save so our connection is created and now it's ready to use in integration so in next video i will create an integration in that integration i will use atp connection to insert the data into atp table or fast the data from atp table so thank you so much for watching if you have any other queries you can comment below and you can ask thank you so much